Hey everybody, you know, this your girl Ash. How y'all doing today? Welcome to my channel. It's called Me and You Forever. What's up? So y'all know what it is. This is a bump up day. Hey, pregnancy blog. So I have been MIA for a minute. I'm sorry about that. So anyway, y'all know what this video is. Two for one. So we're going to talk about 24 weeks and 25 weeks. So stay tuned. See y'all soon. Sugar Ash, how y'all doing today? So, we know what this video is. It's a bump update. Yes, this is a two for one video. So, we are going to talk 24 weeks and 25 weeks. Yes. So, let's get right into it. Um, I'm going to try to remember what happened in those weeks. So, if I do forget, guys, please forgive me. And if I sound under breath, I'm so sorry. That's just pregnancy. So I am just trying to adjust, there you go, adjust my face into the camera. Um, so, and further along than what you are thinking. So I just can't help it that I haven't really blocked enough. So anyway, so let's talk about 24 weeks. Um, and 24 weeks was a weird period. Okay, it's more of, hey, you're starting to grow a lot more. You're starting, your body is doing some weird changes. It's kind of like different from 23. You just go into this weird phase where your body is really starting to form and things are starting to happen. <clears throat> well, to me, this is my third pregnancy. So I have been pregnant three times, um, two successful births. Um, so, yeah, stuff is going to kind of like... Be different and every pregnancy is different especially this one because other stuff that I had in my other pregnancies totally not like this one so <clears throat> let's talk about food food was still the same I could eat good and everything else I finally got up to 200 pounds and then from there um, that was in I want to say the beginning of March because we're like talking about March right about now. Now, in February, I got up to 200 pounds. So it was 201. And then um, and when March hit, I hit the 205 and I stayed there. Uh, hopefully, I stayed there for the rest of my pregnancy. I have a little bit ways to go um, now than I do. So, anyway, so I'm 205 and I stayed there. Um, <clears throat> so we're in, we're, we should be at the end of March, beginning of April, 24 weeks. So, yeah, food was fine, weight was creeping up there, um, doctor was still okay, because I did tell y'all in the last video that I was switching midwives, and switching from midwife going back to doctor, it wasn't my choice, it was because they are delivering at a different hospital, and the hospital I want to deliver at um, is closer to my house. Um, it's closer. So that's the only reason why we are delivering um, 
there at this hospital instead of the one that the midwives are moving to. They're going to be in the same practice. So my visits would have been <clears throat> in the same place. That wasn't an issue. It was just more of we can't do the travel. Um, so we were, we were a little disappointed, me and my husband, but we, we, we kind of moved on from it. So, um, but the new doctor we got, we love her. She's like wonderful. We love her. Um, she's pregnant too, <laughs> by the way. So she's really nice, insightful and everything. So anyway, so let me go into symptoms, symptoms for 24 weeks. It's probably going to be the same thing for 25 weeks. Um, I start to get this weird pain in my up, upper right left cordial region. As y'all know, I had took some blood. Um, my doctor wanted me to get some blood. They wanted me to get a blood panel done of my bowels. So that means pancreas, kidneys, liver, everything. Well, I remember I told you the midwife said, well, if that doesn't come back, um, because I had the itchiness. And I still had the itchiness. Um, and she said, if that doesn't come, if that doesn't come back normal, then we might have to put you on a medication because it's a sign that some part of your body in that area is slowing down. I said, okay. But then she said to me, I remember I said this to y'all in another video, that if it wasn't, then you need to go see a therapist and I just think it's in your head short and sweet without her saying it. Well... I can't go into a little bit more details because there's a lot of more information in my other videos, upcoming videos that I will put in um, to stay on track. So, we don't know what it is. We don't know what it is. It's just, just it, it feels like heartburns and we just don't know what it is now. So, we just got to go back to the doctor and just get testing and see. Um, but anyway, the testing for the bio came back and everything is normal, so we don't know what's going on. And we don't know why I'm having this itchy on it. So that's the symptoms that I'm having. Um, in 24 weeks, my sciatica is on fleek. They finally got me a back race. The back race is helping. It's wonderful. Um, I wear it out in the day. Um, it's a little comfortable, but I don't know if I'm going to keep on wearing it. Because um, of I'm going to get bigger. And I don't know if it's going to stay on that much. So... I don't know if I'm going to still wear it or not. <laughs> Stinks, so. But, uh, yeah, so a back brace. So, I also, too, I want to show you if y'all can see. See this lovely humpy thingy? This is for my sciatica. It is a half of a boppy pillow. Still the boppy company. Um. See that right there? Um, it's half a bumpy pillow. Now that pillow is a lifesaver. Okay, so <clears throat> my sciatica flares up, and sometimes I sleep on my other side morely because it's comfortable. Because the sciatica is so bad to sleep on it hurts. So I'm like, okay, fine. I am going to um sleep like this. So I have got a a uh, I have a program now named called Family Foundations, and they help me to get things, and they come over and give me different parenting tips and advice. Well, she had bought me my ball. I am probably going to upload a picture up in this corner. My birthing ball, and she bought me the pillow. I can use this pillow so many different ways. I can sit on it. I can use it in half of my back, because you know, girls like. Females, you know, we start hurting right in the middle of our back when we get pregnant because you know our back goes and everything. You'd be like, What is going on here? So, I don't get it. So, I use this for my to prop my leg up, um, to take pressure off of it. I also use it for my back. You can sit up like this, or you can switch it any which way. I use this for my bump when I sleep on this side towards my dresser. Um, and then I also have a body pillow that I'm going to probably upload in this corner. I'm probably just going to take a little picture of it, um, the little U-shaped part, and show y'all. Because I ain't going to try like the fiasco of the foot video. Y'all remember the foot video? That was horrible. 
trying to put my feet in and knowing I could just took a picture and just uploaded it. So, doll. But anyway, so, yes, sciatica, eating's okay, gained a little bit weight, and have some crazy testing up in my right quadrant region. Um, don't know what it is, and that's what's happening in 24 weeks. Okay? 25, the same thing. The same thing. Anyway, so it's basically the same symptoms that I'm having. They're just intensifying. Um, I think everything that I'm having right now is leading to something very major. And I just feel like, I don't know. Hold on. I feel like nobody's listening to me. I've been having the same symptoms since... I want to say they started around 20 weeks. And when I had told about the itching, and I think it started with the itching, and I just felt like they're not listening to me, and I really think it's something serious. So, um, I don't know. So maybe I'm just going to have to sit down and have a real serious conversation with my doctor and talk to my gastropath doctor and see what she says. And go from there. That's all I can do. But yes, I am I am feeling the same way I felt in 24 weeks. I'm feeling in 25. Um, so I just hope they pay attention. But anyway, I do have some upcoming videos. I am going to try to do a haul, clothing haul. I just need a little bit more stuff. Because I, I just want to do the video all together and so y'all can see it. The hospital bag uh, video will be coming up soon. Um, what else? And I think that's it. Um, Bailey is doing fine and healthy. As y'all know, I always put the information of how your baby's growing at the end of the video. And you can see that. And you know what? Y'all have a wonderful, wonderful evening. Because it's evening now. Well, it's probably night. I think it's like going on 11 o'clock in my house. Anyway, so y'all have a wonderful night. Remember, this is 24 and 25 week update video. I'm hopefully going to be doing 26 and 27 video update. And I have a question. I got tickets to my favorite concert, Chainsmokers. And is it okay for me to go to the concert? me being pregnant and all so please leave the comments down in the video at the bottom of the screen if it's okay to go to like it's like okay it's like the best concert ever so just please leave your comments and everything in the bottom of the video. hey everybody so please don't forget to like and subscribe at the end of this video um my video is called me and you forever and stay tuned and i will be back live